also known as Nada. Yes. <laughs> so tell us today, um, we, need, we want to know you a little bit better. So tell us where you're from, your roots, where you grew up, where you went to school. Alright, it's been nice being on the program. Um, I'm from Grenville, in St. Andrews. Um, I grew up in Grenville, especially in, in the park. Growing up as a you know, young player, I used to see like five star and St. Andrews training, and I used to be in the park all the time. And um, most of the time, I used to be, you know, not to want to be a goalkeeper, but um, as I was young, I wanted to be involved. Mm-hmm. And I was young, and then I used to see like, when St. Andrews didn't have a goalkeeper, so it was one stand up in the goal. And from there, you know, I kind of get a little bit accustomed to like the goalkeeping. You know? What age was that? I was like 13, 14. You know? Could you give us some of your um, hobbies? What do you like doing? Um, basically, how about football? <laughs> <laughs> um, first of all, I like, I like playing video games. Spending time sometime on the beach, like spending time for myself, you know, and um, helping young kids, especially with um, football at the time. But um, otherwise, I like just being around my friends and stuff and having a fun time. Okay. Do you have any programs for kids that you're administering now or plan to administer? Yeah, um, you know, I plan probably in the next couple of years, you know, um, probably open a good keeping um, program. You want to help the young goalkeepers, you know, and not only goalkeeper, but have a structure and you know, work on certain basic things with the young players. And what club are you attached to now in the country? Uh, well, I used to be for the FA Euro, mm-hmm. and um, but now I'm basically moving back to Trinidad mm-hmm. to be for the World Connection. Alright. And so, um, basically, it's a nice feeling to go back there, you know. Okay, something you're excited about. Yeah. How do you feel representing Grenada? Um, the most important thing with the, with the logo, especially on my chest, I feel 100% representing my family, plus the, the nation, and plus myself, and everyone. And I hope that, you know, all those who are coming up in, in the future, I hope that they will go there and do their best. And the same thing that we all do as national player, do it for our country, ourselves, and our family. Um, what would you want to say to a child looking at this program right now? What would you want to leave us? The most important thing that you have a lot of discipline, and that's the first thing. You know, and I hope that they can be the next goalkeeper in time to come. And I want, them, I want to motivate them that go there and train hard and be the next whoever they want to be. You know, if it's Jason or whoever, you know, David D or whatever. Right. You know, I guess they have the um, well, thank you for coming. Thank you for giving us your time um, and effort. And I would like to add, it's nice that you have plans for the future in terms of helping the youth and, in, and inspiring youth to be, you know, good footballers and uh, personal. So, thank you for coming.